Would you Alexa, like to try? Hush. Thanks, girl. It's hot in here. Bitch, okay. Woo! Beat it. Mm, mm, mm. I have like every TikTok song stuck in my head. Today, I want to do a video. As you can see by the title, I'm not sure what I'm gonna call this yet, but it's gonna be basically like a light makeup look, especially now that we have to wear masks everywhere. Obviously, well, I don't know what y'all, but I, I don't do a full face. Today, we'll be doing a makeup look that is fitting for like a face mask because I don't know about y'all, but I can't do a whole face of makeup and then have to put on a face mask. But that's just a waste of product to me. So. We're just gonna do this look that I've been doing lately since this whole corona thing's been going on. Um, I know I've been MIA, I suck at doing these vlog things, but um, I'm really trying to get at it, you know what I'm saying? It's hotter than a motherfucker up here. Y'all, like, for some reason my air is on, but up here, like, especially in my room, it is not coming through the vents, like, the rest of the house but anyways let's just get right into this video um, I'm gonna do this more of a vlog style I don't really want to do like a whole intro so here's the intro <laughs> um, so yeah first thing is first we're gonna mainly focus up here like down here and lower I'm not even gonna care about so <laughs> yeah let's just jump right into it um so first things first is gonna be the brows I use this total temptation I know the drill. I hate doing my brows, but they have to get done because they look like shit. And just the way my brow, I've been trying to grow my brows out and get them reshaped, but it's not working. So right now I've just been like kind of taming them and like cleaning up the edges so they grow in fully. This shit is not looking good, honey. job of like um posting weekly or however often i should be but with everything going on it's just been really hectic and i don't know um obviously everybody knows about this whole george floyd fiasco and um it happened in my city so kind of hit home a little deeper for me and the fact that one of the police officers I went to high school with had classes with and all that you know it's just been crazy for me and just never thought that that person would turn out to be that way but you know it's just how life is I guess so yeah and it's just a fucked up situation and this whole police brutality thing is just just like it's pretty y'all wasn't gonna tell me I had anything in my nose Ugh. I filled it in with a pencil a little bit all I'm gonna do is go in with this brow gel from brow bar and run that right through there you know what I'm saying I wanna make sure I'm in focus I don't know if the lighting is good like y'all don't know I record on my phone like I have not invested in a real camera yet. I mean, that's goals right there, but I'm trying to grow this channel a little bit more before I go into investing in all of that because that stuff is not cheap. And honestly, I feel like my phone does justice between my phone and um, my iPad. I feel like I get the job done, you know what I mean? Granted, the quality is not the best and the editing is not the best, but I think that just comes with experience too. So we're gonna just clean them up with some concealer. This is the Pretty Vulgar in the shade 296H. And to take this small angled brush by e.l.f. And we're just going to, I don't know if my mirror is in the shot or not, but if I'm looking down, that's because my mirror is down here. And it's just easier for me to look. So I'm just going to put a little bit of product on there and just enhance the brows a little bit more. Right now, guys, I know it's not nothing 
crazy, but I have five subscribers. And to me, I honestly didn't even think I would get one. So I appreciate the five people who are following me right now because um, you guys literally make my day. Every time I see it, that I got a subscriber, I literally just like get so excited and just want to get into doing this some more. Because for a while, I wasn't getting anything and it was just kind of depressing and I felt like nobody liked my content and all that even though some of my videos have been getting views so because I'm a ghetto ass bitch I'm just gonna wet my beauty blender <laughs> with this hairspray thing that just has water in it because I'm too fucking lazy to get up and uh, get it wet so I'm just gonna blend that out a little bit So now that I did my eyebrows, I'm going to go straight in with this contour palette by Too Faced, it's the Coco, Coco Contour. And then I have this billion dollar brush um, and just take it and I'm going to go into the shade Deep Contour and just kind of put that in there. don't put nothing like foundation wise or primer and none of that on my face I just don't have time for that for one it's too hot and then for two the face mask is just gonna smudge it everywhere so I just feel like it's pointless at this point point. and so after the contour we're gonna go in with some shadow well we're gonna go in with some blush from Natasha Denona um, this is the blush duo Oh, okay. So this shade is called Antique Nude. No. This is called Antique Nude. This is called Renee's Pastel Pink. So I kind of like to mix these two colors. Um, I go ham with, with uh, blush because, especially in the summertime, I just love that like sun kissed look. And then I just take this color right here and kind of get my nose pretty good too. It just looks so like natural looking. I'm looking over here because I have a mirror right there too. <laughs> so, right, some white eyeliner just to brighten my eyes a little bit. I'm gonna take some mascara and put it on my waterline or my bottom lashes. This is the Great Lash by Maybelline OG. Honestly, this is the only mascara I own right now, so this is the only one I've been using. I got this Ink Well Liner by um, Kat Von D, right? And like, I've really been wanting to try it, but I cannot do liner for it. Especially liquid liner, I cannot do it for the longest. But it is the prettiest fucking shade ever. Like, I just want to show y'all real quick. Like, look at that color. Like, that is dope. Can you see? Oh! y'all <laughs> all right that was a fail but anyways as i was saying now that i got that all cleaned up and whatnot i literally just wasted like half of this but it is really pretty i don't know if that y'all saw this if i have any product left i'll do a bigger swatch for you look at that color i'm obsessed with it but yeah so one day, I will learn how to use this and use it. But for now, we will stick to what I know because obviously, as y'all just saw, I'm not coordinated enough to use that just yet. So literally all I've done so far was my brows, cleaned it up with concealer, I added some white eyeliner on my waterline, um, mascara on my lower lashes, a little bit of contouring, and some blush, right? Um, that's pretty much it. But because y'all see my full face, I kind of want to do my lips too. So let's just 
add a little bit of product. So first things first, I'm gonna add some more lip balm. This is the Sugar Rush. Um, yeah, the Sugar Rush lip balm and the, I don't even know what shade that is to be honest. I guess they have different shades of this, but yeah, I'm gonna just add a little bit of that on the lips. I have this Fenty lip stick, right? It is so bold, but it is such a pretty color. Whoa. In the shade, I have contacts in, so it's like hard to see really up close. And Candy Venom, I believe that's what it says, right? Something like that, whoa. That is really hard to read, but yeah. And I really wanna try it but it's just not not suitable for this video I don't think it's one of those like uh, like lip changing I'm gonna go in with this vintage lip gloss by Jessica lip skin in the shade pink sequin all right and I'm not the biggest fan of this applicator it's like a brush type applicator and I don't know, I'm just not into those. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of this on there. So yeah, that's the look, really. <laughs> um, don't mind my hair. There's the makeup look, y'all. My everyday look, quarantine edition, mask edition, whatever you wanna call it or take it as, but this is just my go-to for now, just so I don't have to worry about having makeup all over my face and then having to put a mask on and getting it smudged and that's just, ugh. So this I feel like lasts a little bit longer. Um, it's not too much, but at the same time you still look like you're put together. So it works for me. I hope y'all liked my video. Please subscribe to this. Appreciate y'all for watching my videos and y'all just making my day and it's just great to see that people really like are into my videos you know what I'm saying like I don't know but I'm just like really excited and you guys just I don't know <laughs> but yeah so please give me a thumbs up and subscribe all that good stuff comment give me a thumbs up tell your friend tell your friend about me you know what I'm saying like just help us out because I need I need y'all like me and you we need to be like this so yeah but yeah, I'm just gonna end this video here. I know it was short, but I kind of just want to share this with y'all and just show y'all that I'm still here and still committed to this channel and just want to really grow it more and just be more consistent. I know I've been saying this, but just with everything going on, it's just a lot. So I'm going to get back on it. I promise y'all. I promise. But yeah, that was the look, everybody. Hope y'all enjoyed my video. Please subscribe. Bye.